What do we got? What do we got? That is, that's a whiting. What? A whiting. Whiting. First fish. So I'd go tip it with some new shrimp right. and then chunk it back out. So here's our setup. We've got four rods out here along the beach. Each one has got a pompano rig baited with a fish bite and a piece of shrimp. So far we caught one whiting and we're getting plenty of bites. So fingers crossed one of these is a pompano. Come on, pompano. Nope, same thing. <laughs> That's all right, at least we know there's fish here. Yeah. You've got twofer. Both whiting. <laughs> We're getting good at these. Hey, that looks like a real fish. Woo, get him. This one's got slack in the line. I bet you something, something's probably got it and swam towards us with it. It's a croaker. They look like, they look like the whiting, but they're kind of, see how they're taller? Okay. That's a croaker. Here, come here. Listen to him. Yeah. Croaker. <laughs> <laughs> so here's what I'm doing here. I've got these little two watt circle hooks on this pompano rig. And we're just putting a little piece of fish bite on there and then a little piece of shrimp on top of it. Let's see what we got here. There's a couple it looks like. So the other thing that we can do is just kind of vary where we're casting. Change it up a little bit. Because those pompano could be closer in or further out. Does he look different? Yeah, like a little tiny thing. That's a pompano! Woo! Good job, dude! <laughs> you got one! There it is! That's pompano. There he is. We caught the pompano. They're cool, right? Yeah, man, that's cool. Like, nose? Yeah. They're cool neat. little fish. Yeah. Hell yeah, man. Good job. That's awesome. Cool. We're going to let this one go because he's a little on the small side, but the bigger ones we're going to keep. Man, I love it when a plan comes together. Yeah. Yep. You got one. Same. Pompano. That one's a little bigger. No, that's not a pompano. What is it? Yours didn't have fins like that, right? Uh -uh. I wish I had a, a book on me. That's really cool. That is cool. Pretty cool. Okay, so after further investigation, it turns out that this fish is called a polymeta. Super cool looking fish. Looks a whole lot like a pompano. That is really cool. Well, we're catching whiting nonstop. A croaker or two in the mix and then two pompanos so far so not a bad morning i've got my buddy josh and mark out here with me this morning mark's from washington so he's having a a great time down here in texas fishing the fish in the coast
That's a little, that's called a Jack Crevel. Oh, nice. And they're cool. Nice. Yeah, I like the color. Yeah, that is a neat fish, isn't it? Yeah. They'll get big. They get like, like, well, they'll get huge. Really? And they are hard fighters. Like this little guy pulled really hard. Cool. All right, I made the bait smaller. I cut the fish bites into tiny little like chiclet sized pieces and then the shrimp into tiny little pieces too. Those pumpano have tiny mouths, so I'm hoping that will attract more of them. We're catching bigger ones casting further out. That one's got a little pull to him. It is a big whiting. Not exactly the fish we're after, but I would rather catch something than nothing at all. It's just a blast being out here. We should have a race. Whoever catches a fish first. We gotta cast at the same time though. Ready? Okay, go. <laughs> oh, buddy. I gotta land it though. Little bitty guy. Ladies and gentlemen, that is gonna do it for this video. It turned out to be a really fun morning. We caught all kinds of fish just non-stop. So if you're wanting to do any surf fishing, I would definitely suggest getting out here pretty early. 
you all have a wonderful week and I'll see you next Tuesday.